Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another video on my channel. Today we are back in Stormworks yet again, and today we're continuing on with our IFV. Now if you look at this thing, honestly, it is looking pretty good. Uh, it's almost done. Uh, but what I want to do is change a few things. So, for example, uh, the smoke screen on the back clearly doesn't work very well. But apparently, apparently, there is a setting that uh, makes it work. So, um, we're going to go ahead and change those guys. We're also going to make this thing have a parachute on it, so if we drop it out of a plane, or whatever, um, it is actually able to parachute down. I think that would be really cool. So, um, yeah, that's what we're going to do today. Let's get on with it. Alright, so, first things first, let's have a little look at this and see if there is anything we can actually do about it. Smoke parachute, chaff. Smoke parachute. I, I think this might be what they were talking about, I'm not entirely sure. Uh, but we'll try it. So smoke parachute, smoke parachute, smoke parachute. There we go. Smoke parachute. Yes. I, I don't know whether this is going to work as a smoke screen, but it might. We'll see. Uh, and then we'll do another one. There we go. All right. Let's, uh, let's drive this along and pop it and see what happens. I'm not sure it's going to work the way that uh, the person that said it was going to work is going to expect it to work. 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 You know? Anyway, let's drive it out of here. And there we go. And we'll deploy our smoke screen. Three. Two, one. It's just the same. It is just the same. Okay, never mind. Let's make this thing airworthy. Let's do it. Okay, so, um, I am not entirely sure how I want this to work, but I'm thinking we delete that right there, and we have a parachute located directly in there. Uh, I'm assuming that'll be fine. So grab this and put it there. Excellent. We're then going to go ahead and attach one to the rear. Uh, around here. Hopefully this will be good too. I'm assuming it will be. So, um, yeah. Okay, good. Let's go ahead and whack that on here. Number four is going to be our parachute. Number four is parachute. There we go. All right, let's go ahead and label it real quick. Four. Uh, four. Parachute. Parachute. Okay, right. We need to be able to test this somehow, and I don't want to put it in a plane in order to take it up into the sky. So, I'm going to test it a different way. One second. Alright, so here we are. This is our testing ground. Is it going to work or is it not going to work? Who knows? Let's do this. Turn it on. There we go. Headlights. Let's go ahead and turn those on too and drive off. Here we go. Okay, press 4. Okay, parachutes have been activated. And we are falling down not the best. Honestly, how fast are we going? We're going faster than it actually drives. I think this is going to damage us quite badly, actually. We'll see. Here we go. Three, two, one. Yeah. No. Okay, right. Parachutes don't work. <laughs> they don't work. All right. We're back up at the top again. Let's go ahead and see if this works this time. I'm assuming it will. Uh, essentially, I've gone ahead and make them, made them like twice the size. I've also put another one in the front so that it actually lands um, flat, hopefully. So let's go ahead and drive off again. Here we go. Press four. Parachutes open. There we go. And... Oh, they are so much bigger this time, but we're still having the same issue. How fast are we dropping? Okay, a little bit slower. Just a little bit slower. Okay, turn the engine off. Okay, headlights on. Is this going to work? I, I still feel like it needs to be a little bit better than this. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, it blew up again. Okay, we can't have that. We can't. All right, here we go. This time, this time, maybe it will work. Uh, essentially, what I've done now is I've added two more to the front. Oh, no, I've deleted the hatch. Ah. Okay, right. Well, if this works, that's that's fine. All anyway, right, here we go. All right, parachute's popped. There we go. And this time, it's still angled towards the front. A little bit annoying, but we should be falling slower. It's not actually changing it all that much. We added two more parachutes, and we're still falling very quickly considering um yeah okay let's try and get the wheels going or the tracks moving so that when we land we rock it away <laughs> i don't know whether that's a good idea all right here we go mm. now nah. okay right i i don't know how we do this then i i legit don't know how we do it because if every time it's gonna land on its front like that there's not much i can do all right, guys, uh, I've changed it up even more this time. So if we have a little look at this, uh, we've got a parachute there. We've got a parachute there. We've got a parachute there. We have a parachute on the back right there and another one on this side. We then have one on the inside uh, right there, uh, which is interesting. 
Um, and the ones at the back are actually uh, smaller than the ones at the front, which should mean that it is less... I don't know. We'll see. All right, here we go. Drive off. There we go. It's just not going to work, is it? It's just not going to work. Because every time it lands, it lands quite hard. I think I have an idea, though. I do actually have an idea for this. We're going to put some skis underneath, and uh, that'll stop the blow, if that makes sense. It's probably a good idea anyway, but here we go. Oh, it landed properly. It actually landed properly. Okay, good. It works. Woohoo! Nice. All right, so let's go ahead and put some skis on this thing if we can fit them. Uh, I wouldn't like them all the way at the front, but if we are able to put them here, that'd be excellent. So, ski. Let's go with the small ones. Here we go. And hopefully this is enough to um, to work properly. So, don't do it mirror mode because that does break these, but we'll go ahead and smash that in there like that. Point it forwards. We'll then go ahead and smash this one in here the same way and point it forwards. There we go. All right, so now we got the skis on the bottom. It, obviously, that's not amazing, but it works. It does. All right, just to be sure that these actually work then, we're also going to go to the rear, and we're going to try and implant some back here too. So delete that one and delete this one. Try and put ourselves a ski in, and try and put ourselves a ski in here also. And uh, we should do okay there. Let's go ahead and save this as is. IFV, there we go. Awesome. Go ahead and paint the inside of these to make sure that they actually look nice. There we go, and there we go. And I don't know where the interior one is over here, but that's fine. So save it as is. There we go. Good. Go ahead and spawn it in the sky and see if this helps. All right. Everybody ready? Three, two, one. Let's go. Come on. Drive. Yeah. Woo. All right. Off we go. All right. Parachutes have been popped. There we go. Excellent. Our speed is going to go down to about nine, as it did last time, which is excellent as well. Hopefully, it does actually go down to that. Otherwise, we might have some more issues. We'll see. Um, it looks silly. Like, it does look very silly. I might actually make the rear parachutes the same size as the, the front ones. Um, just to make it look like one big parachute. It's probably a good idea. Anyway, it landed nicely, and we're able to drive away. That's it. That's all we need. Okay, you will also notice that I've added some flares and stuff to the, uh, to the actual thing itself. Uh, I don't know how to even explain that. I've added them to the, the, the thing. <laughs> I've added them to the thing, guys. Okay, so 10 meters per second, 10 meters per second. Those are going to be smoke ones on the front. So let's go ahead and make it smoke. White, there we go. And smoke. All right, good. Uh, and we're going to go ahead and attach those to our smoke screen, I think. Uh, what is this? I don't know what's labeled what, actually. So one is flares, two is smoke screen. We'll put it on two. Um, da -da -da, two, back there, whack that on there, and whack it on there. Excellent. Well, also, actually, um, I, I think this will be flares, actually. So, it's gone to there, it's gone to there, it's gone to there. Now it goes from there to here, and from there to here also. And those are actually going to be white illumination flares. Uh, and they're not going to fire out too far. 20 meters per second, go. Yes. Okay, so now that we've done all of that, we should be good to go. I think I need more ammo in this thing, too. I do. I feel like I need more ammo. There is something else that I can do as well, is actually add more people in here, uh, or the capacity to carry more people. Um, but I guess that could be like a full-on troop transport one. This one can actually carry some storage too. I don't know. I mean, that's up to us, to be fair. Like, I could, if I wanted to, just go ahead and start smacking a bunch of these down. Um, but it's a bit weird. Um, ammo. Ammo? Maybe these will actually fit. They do. So I, I could technically put that in there. Like that? I mean, I don't know whether I like the idea of it, but maybe. All right, delete that. Put it on like this. It's kind of interesting. Okay, because then we get more rounds, and we can actually um, reload our gun as well, which is always pretty good. So, uh, heavy auto cannon. We're going to go with high explosive. There we go. All right, sick. That's actually really cool. So, now, let's go ahead and save it. There we go. Let's go ahead and spawn it in, and see if we can still drive it. If we can, that's great. Alright, here we go. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Close this. We can still get round here. Yeah, okay. Everything still works. And that's fine. Okay, but now it can actually be airdropped. That's really cool. That is really, really cool. Okay, so flares. One, two, three, four. 
Five, six. There we go. Okay, right. That's all cool. Press, uh... Oh, no, no, not three. That's reverse. There's our smoke screen. Okay, that's pretty cool. And then if we press four, that's our parachutes. But obviously we don't need those. Do we still... Are we stable, still able to work in the water? Yes, indeed we are. Of course we are. That's cool. That is very cool. I don't know whether we'll be able to parachute down into water. But, um... Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, let's do one more parachute test and see if it works. Oh, I have another idea too, actually. One second. I need another camera. So, this camera in the middle is obviously our driver's camera. But when we're in reverse, clearly we can't see anything. So, we're going to go ahead and add a camera right here. Delete that. And put it in there like so. Interesting. Um, and, yeah, we're going to go from this. Da, 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 video. Oh, no. This isn't quite how it works. How do you... How do you switch between video feeds? I don't actually know. Hmm. I'll have to create a microcontroller for that. Actually, for now, we'll leave it. For now, we'll leave it. Um, but yeah, we can create a microcontroller that allows us to, as soon as we press reverse, which I, I think is three, um, we can change the camera to be this camera instead of that camera. Um, and then we'll have an actual backup camera, which is or a reversing camera, which would be really cool. That'd be really cool. Anyway, save this as is. IFV, save. And uh, get it in the sky. And hopefully, you guys can see this, right? Yeah, you guys can see this. Uh, we're going to go ahead and spawn this in. And hopefully, this will work. So, as long as this still actually is able to land properly, we're going to be good. All right, turn this on. There we go. Sit in the seat. Do the thing. Yep, headlights, sure. Three, two, one, go. Actually, should we do it in reverse? I've never gone off backwards. Whee! There we go, parachutes. There we go, very nice. Maybe I should have gone up forwards. But anyway, we should be able to jump out of here. Maybe. I say I say that like we can. Alright, there we go. And push these <laughs> I wanna push those down. I want it to look nice as it as it falls. Not something we can do, never mind. Um, but we are landing actually a lot nicer this time. Like this is actually a lot nicer, so. If we start off right, it'll be fine. And knock that off the side. I can't seem to. Oh, there we go. And we're good to go. Excellent. All right. I think we've done an excellent job with this thing. Um, the last thing that I want to do is change its color. I, I, I do. I want to change its color to look different. All right. So you might ask, what color are you going to do then? Uh, I genuinely don't know. I kind of feel like a fictional colored tank, like a, like a gold would be interesting, like a golden blue. Uh, but I genuinely don't know. Maybe we should go back to the green. Like, that is a cool green. Let's go ahead and spawn it in. That doesn't look too bad at all. In fact, yeah, let's let's color it this color. I do like the previous color, so we can go back to it, but let's go ahead and uh, paint this, and then we'll probably leave it there. Yeah. All right, so there it is. It is in green now. I actually don't mind it in green. I think this looks okay. Uh, if we go to the rear, I do need to paint that a little bit still, but that is that is it. Uh, anyway, let's go ahead and drive this thing off, and um, hopefully, 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 it'll work still. Here we go, we've driven off. Alright, we are falling. I haven't pressed the parachute yet, I'm gonna now. There we go. Oh yeah! Alright, well, anyway, that is gonna be it for today's video. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. See you next time. Goodbye.